the year. It's snowfall. Not often we get a chance to settle back and enjoy the very, very best. But now, three minutes of, of that from snowfall is what we're hoping for and expecting. She's 92 on to win the Verme. This is her stepping stone to the arc. They're away. For my group one over 2,400 metres and La Jacon towards the inside in the table colours is first to go. Settled into second position is Bergerita, the brown jacket on the near side with Teona on the inner. Pellier concentrating on just getting her to switch off. The one who's going right down the centre of the track is Joan of Arc in the white cap. Favourite snowfall in fourth position towards the inside, followed by Philomene and finally Incaville at the back of the field. As they make their way, no great pace down the far side, and it's La Jaconde and Holly Doyle showing by two lengths to Teona and Olivier Pellier second. And on the outside is Joan of Arc, Euritz Mendithabal, Bergerita follows for Maxime Guillon, then Snowfall and Frankie de Tori. Finally, we have Philomene, Mikhail Barcelona and Incaville and Christophe Sumion as they continue down the far side. Tiona still just a little bit free on the inner despite being tucked in behind La Jaconde as the runners go towards the end of the back straight and just begin the downhill swing. So La Jaconde by a length. Joan of Arc second position, Tiona third, Bergerita fourth. Then behind these, Snowfall, who's damn best in the world. We're going to find out whether her offspring is mainly is going to live up to this name. Maybe not today, but maybe in the arc. She's racing fifth. Dottori doesn't seem too concerned by being about six or seven lengths behind the leaders as they make the swing into the false straight. It's La Jaconde still in front of Joan of Arc on the outside. Tiona follows in third. Bergerita Snowfall a little bit closer now, being tracked by Philomene and then Incaville on the inner. So down to the 700 they go, getting ready to make the swing into the straight. And as they do so, Joan of Arc now moves up on the outside of La Jaconde. Here goes Snowfall on the outside, trying to pick these up. La Jaconde and Joan of Arc, who's just rolling around. He's having to get serious on Snowfall, but Snowfall is now coming on the near side, but he's got the whip out. Bergerita is taking this one on. Teona on the near side has come through, and Teona has got to the front. It's Teona being chased by Snowfall, but Teona is going to provide a big upset here. Teona wins it from Snowfall, whose colours have been lowered in second. And back in third was La Jaconde. Well, Teona and Olivier Pellier has won the Prix Fermaille. Always highly thought of. Disappointing earlier in the season.